I want to thank my sponsor for today's video, Fantasy Heroes Demon Rising by Cloud Games Limited. Fantasy Heroes Demon Rising is a strategy action role-playing game. It's available for both Android and iOS devices and it's absolutely free. Already it has 10,000 plus downloads on Google Play Store while maintaining a very high rating of 4.8 out of 5 stars. With this game, you can enjoy the following features. Number 1, it's a 3D game with VR functionality. Number 2, you can enhance pets to assist you on your missions. Number 3, there are 3 basic characters to choose from that suits your gameplay style. And number 4, you can team up with your friends and have fun while winning together. Support my channel by supporting my sponsors too. Download Fantasy Heroes Demon Rising now. Hey guys, this is Mr. Pogzamar and today I will show you what will happen if we will combine an Iron Golem and a Trident in Minecraft. Pocket Edition. So we will need the following items, a uh, block of gold and lapis lazuli block. So what we're going to do is to dig the ground. It must be 3x3, three three, just like this. And we're gonna put here uh, the block of gold. So there must be 9. So we need to dig all the way down here until we see the bedrock. So up to 3 blocks deep. And uh, we will go down, and uh, again, we will take this part right here up to three blocks. So, meaning there's uh, like three by three by two hole here. And uh, what we're going to do is to go up. This time, I'm gonna use the lapis lazuli block for the pillars. So, there's gonna be uh, four pillars. There we go. So are there four? There must be four. All right, there we go. Next, we need uh, the button, the rail, the powered rail, the detector rail, minecart witches, and a uh, spruce trap door. So what we're going to do is to uh, put here the button, and then I'm gonna dig here and I'm gonna put the spruce uh, trap door. Now let's dig this part right here up to one block uh, deep only. So let's put back uh, the grass block there. So let's dig this part as well. I'm gonna put there the powered rail and uh, more rails going this way. And then I'm gonna get rid of this until we see the bedrock. Next we need the chest, the hopper, the redstone comparator, the redstone dust, and of course the redstone repeater. So what we're going to do is to put here uh, the chest and then we must be sneaking and uh, we're gonna put there the hopper so let's sneak there we go and uh, make sure the hopper is uh, attached directly to the chest so uh, let's dig this part right here as well so that we can see everything here you see it attached there we go so it must be straight Next, at the back of the chest, I'm gonna put uh, the resin comparator, so it must be facing that way. And then we're gonna add here a redstone dust, and then a redstone repeater going this way. Another uh, redstone repeater going that way, and this time we're gonna dig this part. Next, we're gonna use the command block, so for us to get it, uh, we need to type here slash give at p and then it must be a uh, command underscore block there we go and uh, where's my command block it must be here and uh, i will put a one here it must be uh, facing this way so make sure the arrow is uh, facing this way and then i will add another one so let's just take this so that it will be easier there we go so the two arrows must be facing that way next uh, we will get uh, some coordinates so i will put here a lapis lazuli block and i will stand here and i will get the coordinates so uh, mine is negative 35 and uh, negative 209 so yours will be different you should have paper and ball pen uh, while doing this so me i'm using paper and ball pen as well while recording so what we're going to do is to uh, go down here again and then i'm gonna put here the command on the first command block so it must be summon 
uh, make sure the spelling is correct otherwise this will not work so it must be some summon lightning underscore bolt and uh, we're going to uh, type the coordinates so mine is negative 35 and negative 209 there we go and uh, it must be a uh, impulse block type impulse and then needs redstone next we'll go to the next command block and here we're gonna summon this time it's gonna be x-men and then colon uh, it must be wolverine there we go and uh, you must uh, enter the coordinates so mine is negative 35 and then negative 209 so you might be wondering why is it x-men wolverine you can find it uh, anywhere uh, it's not working it's because uh, you need to use an add-on here so I'm going to leave the link for that add-on in the description down below so uh, the block type must be chain and then red zone always active so there we go it must turn into green and then finally we will uh, use another command block here and this time the command must be kill at e and then uh, it must be type equal uh, the entity must be iron golem so it must be iron underscore golem there we go so there must be the bracket and that's it so all we have to do is to go up right now and then we just need to cover everything let's now put uh, some grass blocks here by the way i need to add a rail here on top of the hopper so for us to do that we must be sneaking there we go and then uh, more grass blocks here and then i will just add some stained glass uh, up to three layers so, as well as on this side and also here now in the uh, on front we need to do the same thing but this time uh, we just need to uh, get rid of this suit first because we're gonna go inside later so i'll put here more a uh, block of gold and right now it's raining so let's get rid of first of the rain uh, what we're going to do is to type here the command it must be a uh, weather slash weather and then clear and there we go we don't have the rain is it all right so i'll put uh, more here and as you can see there's like the plus sign take a look at that uh, from this perspective it's gonna be x we will also need a redstone lamp and of course the lever so we just need to put here five redstone lamps and of course the lever turn it on and there we go uh, there's slide inside and basically we're done with the machine so all we have to do is to summon the iron golem inside so what we're going to do is to uh, make a letter t made of block of iron and of course the pumpkin so just to that and there we go there's the iron golem and let's see what will happen if we're going to push this button but first we need to get first the minecart which is of course the trident so let's open the trap door so what we're going to do is to put here the minecart which is open it and just put the trident right there and just close the trap door and there we go as you can see we have the iron golem which is of course made of metal and of course we have the trident inside the minecart with chess and uh, we're gonna push this button so if we're gonna combine the trident and the iron golem what will happen that's the question let's find out let's just close this so that uh, the iron golem cannot escape all right so let's now push the button what do you think will happen let's see so let's now push it there we go there's the lighting oh my goodness there's a new entity inside the iron golem is gone and it's replaced by oh my goodness who is this it's familiar look at this oh my goodness it's wolverine and it's moving right now look at the claws 
So the claws are like the trident, of course. I wanna find out if a uh, Wolverine is neutral or hostile. So let's go to survival mode. But first, we need to clear the inventory. So let's type here slash, and then clear, and then let's go to uh, game mode, uh, survival. There we go. And uh, I wanna set uh, my uh, world spawn here. So set world spawn. Uh, set world spawn there we go and it must be this so there we go and uh, let's try to punch uh, Wolverine let's see what will happen oh he's attacked oh look at that look at the animation I like it look have you seen oh my goodness I like the animation can we do that again let's see let's see but this time uh, let's try to wear some armor so uh, let's go back to game mode C and let's wear some armor right here. There we go. Of course, we're going to use the diamond so that it's going to be stronger. And uh, let's see what will happen. So uh, just take a look at the animation. Let's go game mode S. Take a look at the animation of the hands of Wolverine and let's see what will happen. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Oh my goodness, it's so detailed just like in real life. Oh my goodness, he's using his claws like that. That's so awesome. Wolverine can actually heal himself. So let's see what will happen if uh, we will strike him with the diamond sword. Let's see what will happen. So how many hits will you take before you die? Let's see. Oh my goodness. So looks like Wolverine is indestructible. Is he? Is he really indestructible? Look at this. He can heal himself so fast. Is this the strongest mob in Minecraft? Look at this. You can't even kill him. Oh my goodness. So uh, let's try to use command. So it must be a slash kill at E. Let's see what will happen. Oh my goodness. It did not kill. It did not kill him. What? Have you ever are you listening? Damn.